Get our bags and here introducing the new magnetic X-Men bell. So the bell is a new X-Men pyramid, the sun brand of G, so obviously instead of ball bearings, they're gonna magnets in it. It's kinda interesting for their attempt as the Mori Harris does, and it's cool little violin logo that has customized on it, but has been wearing out since the solves I've been doing on it. So just quick show you the little box that it comes with it if you're wondering what it looks like. It's just your standard little Chi pyramid box with the writing in the black model. And the famous Matt's Volk is going to be on the other side of the box as well, so don't forget to say hi. Now more to the pyramids. This is made by X-Men, obviously, so you have that cool little X-Men logo. It is also my first stickerless pyramid. It is, is available in stickerless, which is really, really nice, so I'm going to show you the turning real quick. Yeah. The performance of this pyramid is actually really good. It has a smooth, buttery and sorta of clickish feeling. It feels a tiny bit different from the ball bearings when it's the magnets. Um, let's compare this to the first pyramids that they had from Chi. If you see my unboxing for that, even though I took the ball bearings out of it, the plastic just feels a tiny bit more different. It might be me, but it's just that this after breaking in feels a bit, that plastic feels a bit more hard and pieces clacking each other. While this one just feels soft and substantial. Well, uh, it just feels a bit more pleasant than this one. Feels a tiny bit more clacky and harsh when you turn it. And the tips on this one, that's just like any other Chi Pyraminx. It's um, scratchy and a tiny bit more dry. Well, of course, after breaking it, it's going to be like this one, glidey and smooth. But this one doesn't, but these two pyramids are both really great. And size is, um, I think they're the exact same size. Yes, they are. Or they might, or one of them might be a bit smaller. So this pyramid has a great potential being my main. So let's just do a solve here. All right, just scrambling this up. I haven't done a pyramid solve in a while. I'm pretty ter terrific at pyramids. All right. Let's give this go. Whew. Okay. Looking through the camera isn't always the best thing to do as well. Still working on it. Ah, uh, what am I doing here? Ah, oh, just screwed up that algorithm. Well, there we go, there we go. But really good pyramid, um, feels really well, and then it just clicks into place really nicely when it's the magnets. It's a tiny bit better than the ball bearings, in my opinion. And it feels really nice. It could, be, I don't know if this is going to be my main or not, so for my Mary and Chi, this one feels soft and buttery. Really good. Corner cutting isn't even a problem as well. Cuts at a fair amount, cuts about half a piece, half a pyramid piece. Um, the tensions are fairly loose on mine. Cuts really well. Reverse as well is really nice. It doesn't have those crazy corner cuttings yet, but it does cut really well to prevent some lockups. Overall, the Chi Pyraminx is really good. I think it's one of the best Pyraminxes out there, along with the Moyu Magnetic. And probably a bit better than the original Chi Pyramid. So that's about it for my first impressions. Quite long. And I'll see you next time in my next video. Bye.